yeah hello there and welcome back and let us continue with our lesson over here and let's try to learn the dot three new feature over here and we will be looking into the class modifier and the most interesting thing for us currently is the interface and using this interface we'll be modifying our or we will be upgrading or refactoring our actual project so let's go and create the new file over here and let's call this one as the animal dot file. so let's go and create the uh, interface over here interface and then the class and that will be of the animal intr animal interface over here and now we can go and add some uh, functionality so let's go and add the function or the method over here so i'll just go and call the void and to walk over here or we'll just say can walk walk over here and now if i try to create the abstract function over here it doesn't allow so the interface now you can see it's just like the class over here it needs a function with a body or a method with a body so if you try to just use a as the abstract over here you can't do that with just a, a interface keyword over here so once you use an interface keyword you have to make sure that your body or your function body has the implement or your function has the body or the implementation so i'll just go and write something over here so let's go and print something so once we have uh, this let's go and try to add some comment over here and now you see that to define an interface we will use the interface modifier which is of this one library outside of the uh, interface on defining library can implement the interface but not extend it so that is the thing so it cannot be extended over here it can only be implemented outside of this library so in the dart we consider this particular file as the uh, library itself so this class or this file is a library itself so once you go out of this particular library you can't implement or you can't extend it but you can only implement this particular interface so that is the uh, concept over here it's just like the normal class over here but you can just go and you can only implement it but you cannot extend it so that's the difference over here so once i go and add the let's go and add a new file over here and let's call this one as the uh, main dot the dot file over here and if i go and create the final and if i have let's say uh, a n i m a n i m l animal one which is of equal so i'll just go and call the uh, a n i m l animal interface that we have and if i try to construct it uh, you will see that we can construct it uh, let's say a main and now i can just go and call the uh, let's go and cut this section and let's paste it inside over here and now i can just go and call the animal dot the i can just go and call and walk over here so now you can see we can construct this particular class so you can see that our entire interface can be can be c u n s t r u c constructed so you can see that now we can construct this particular uh, interface and if i go over here and let's say final uh, not the final if i let's say if i have a class over here and class animal one and if i go and try to extend this particular animal uh, an animal interface that we have uh, it will give us an error so the class animal interface can't be extended outside of this library so you can't extend this one okay and let's try to comment out this one as well over here let's copy this and let's try to comment out and now if i go and add a new one over here and that will be of the implements over here and now i can go and implement over here and i can just go and say the uh, print the uh, object like let's say i'll just go and call this one the animal interface h o v e r r i d e n overridden over here so if i try to implement it outside of that particular uh, library you can see that we can just go and implement it 
but we can't extend it but what you can do is you can just copy this same thing over here and if i go back to the interface and if i try to do the same thing over here it is allowed so let's say if i uncomment this one over here and let's say this one is of the animal too over here now you can uh, either extend it or you can either implement it on the same package over here this is considered the same package this is not the same package because it's outside of this particular file and once we go over here now you can see that we have the animal one over here and we have the walk so if i go and try to construct that one over here let's try to go and say the final and i'll just use the uh, ani ml animal and let's say our animal one which is of equals to the animal one that we have over here and i'll just cut this section from here and let me just go and paste it over here and let's try to comment this one out as well just don't call it over here so once we have this uh animal one is a little defined i guess so let's say this is of the uh just a animal um interface over here and now we have the animal one animal one dot the we'll just go and call the uh can walk over here and if i try to go and run this one we'll get that the animal interface is overridden because we have already overridden over here with with the implementation over here and now let's go back to the animal interface over here and with this interface what we can do over here is you can take a look we can just go and construct that which we don't want with our interface actually because we don't want to have the we don't want to construct the class for our interface over here that is the one point over here and, and this is cool so we can't extend it anymore that's perfectly fine for us and we can implement it but what we want to do is instead of having a function with a body we also want to have a function without a body or the abstract function over here so how we can achieve that one is let's go and copy this code from here and let's paste it below over here and let's say this one is the abstract abstract animal interface over here so let's go and call this one as the we what we have to do is we have to make it as the abstract interface class over here and now what i can do over here is i can go and call the void and i can do a can eat over here and now i can have the uh, function or the method without the body or the abstract function over here so how we can do that is abstract interface class so this is quite long but uh, you can still achieve what you want over here this is a pure abstract over here so let's go and try to add the some command over here and now you can see we have added some comment over here the most common use case of the use for the interface modifier is to define a pure interface so which means that if you want to use a pure interface what we can do is we need to combine with the abstract modifier so abstract interface class so this is the way you can define a pure interface in the dot three over here like the interface class and the other library can implement it but you cannot inherit which means you cannot extend it from the pure interface over here that's cool so that is the what that is the feature that we want as well as the abstract class uh, like the any pure interface can have the abstract member so now we can have the abstract member as well as so this is the pure interface with the dart tree that we can implement it's quite long abstract interface class and uh, the interface class over here but now if you go back to the main over here and uh, let's try to just copy this all of this particular code from here and if i go down below over here and let's say this is of the animal uh, uh abstract animal let's say uh, a b s t r c t a n i m l animal and here we'll just call the uh, abstract animal interface over here and now it can't it can't uh, it can't be constructed so you can see now you cannot construct this particular interface or the abstract interface anymore so that's cool so that is what we want and previously with the interface we were able to uh, do the construction of this particular class but now we can't do that so that's cool so that is the new feature that we want over here and also if i go back to this one 
and if I try to uh, let's go and implement that one over here so just copy this and let's try to implement this one over here I guess we have to use it too I guess it's already there okay so I I can't extend it anymore so you can see that the abstract interface can't be extended outside its own library because it's a interface over here so you can just copy this particular code and you can replace it over here and let's have this particular as the comment over here and let's break the line over here and let's just go and uh, comment this one out over here let's comment this one as well and now we have a animal let's go and say this is of the animal too and we'll try to implement this particular over here and we'll just go and override the missing functionality now it can also eat over here so now we'll just go and say just copy this and paste it over here animal interface not this is of the abstract animal interface each or, or we can say just go and say that and next what you can do is uh, this one can wlk walk that's fine so let's go down and let's copy the whole thing from here again and just go and uh, paste it below so this one will be of the animal too over here and this will be of the animal 2 as well over here so now we can just go and say that animal 2 can walk as well as the uh, animal 2 can eat right so we can walk and can eat over here so let's try to go and run over here now you can see that abstract interface can walk and abstract interface animal interface can eat over here so now we can accomplish what we have done so now we cannot extend it right and we cannot what we cannot do is we cannot construct that particular abstract interface over here so that is what we want over here using this concept what we'll do we'll go and refactor our code over here so let's go and open up our project and let's go and try to refactor our code over here so let's go to the package and our auth over here we'll go to the library and the features and let's go to the login and we'll go to first of all the uh, repository class over here and we have the interface over here previously we were using the abstract over here now what we have to do is abstract interface over here inter fac interface over here so abstract interface class over here and we got some error that's because i guess we haven't upgraded our uh, dart version so let's go to pubspec.yml file over here and let's try to upgrade our uh, stk over here that is of the uh, three that o.2 and less than the 4 over here so that should be fine and let's try to go and run the uh, the flutter pub kit over here or you can just go and get it and get the packages from here and let's go back to our repository now once we upgrade our dart sdk we are good to go so now we have the uh, pure abstract a uh, pure uh, interface over here which is of the abstract interface class so now we don't get any error but we get the new feature that what we get uh, what was not previously over there so now if i go to the uh, login repository and i have uh, the implementation over here so uh, we don't get any error so it's working perfectly fine so what you can do is you can go to the application and we have an interface over here so what you have to do is intr if a interface you just have to add the interface over here and the rest of the thing doesn't need to be changed over here so now we just have migrated it to the dart 3 with the pure interface over here so that's cool so you can just go and do the same thing for our rest of the packages let's go to the uh, repository over here and we'll just go and change this one to the abstract and interface over here and that's cool so we have that and let's go back to our application and now we'll go to the uh, sign up over here this is an interface so we just need to make this one as the abstract interface because we don't have any of the implementation over here we are just using as the interface and that's cool so i guess that's the thing that we can do over here what you have to do is you have to go and upgrade all of your rest of the packages and change the abstract to the abstract interface so we are migrating it to the dart tree over here so for now uh, we'll just uh, stop here and we'll meet up in the next lecture so make sure you just go and try to upgrade the rest of the packages over here so let's meet up in the next lecture till then have a great day